I spoke with Brittany Griner. She's safe. She's on a plane. She's on her way home. After months of being unjustly detained in Russia, held under intolerable circumstances, Brittany will soon be back in the arms of her loved ones, and uh, and she should have been there all along. Women's basketball player Brittany Griner has been released from Russian custody during a one-for-one -one prisoner swap. U.S. officials announced that an exchange agreement was negotiated with Russian officials days ago. The prisoner exchange took place in the United Arab Emirates as U.S. officials released international arms dealer Victor Bout in exchange for Griner. The basketball player's release comes months after Griner was detained in a Russian airport on drug charges, after security officials discovered she was carrying cannabis oil cartridges in her luggage. Griner was arrested and she pleaded guilty to the charges, admitting during her trial that she uses cannabis medicinally and unintentionally brought it in her luggage. Griner was sentenced to nine years in prison, one short of the maximum sentence. I made an honest mistake and I hope that in your ruling that it doesn't end my life here. The State Department revealed this summer that it had offered a substantial proposal to retrieve Grinder and Paul Whelan, another American whom the Biden administration considers wrongfully detained. I plan to raise an issue that's a top priority for us. The release of Americans Paul Whelan and Brittany Grinder. We put a substantial proposal on the table weeks ago facilitate their release. Whelan is currently serving a 16-year prison sentence after being convicted of espionage charges that he vehemently denies. He was not included in the swap for Griner.